What's up guys? This is Miss Fao and you are watching Math Enthusiast. Different features of a parabola where the vertex is at the origin. So there are different features of a parabola. We have here a parabola that opens upward, downward, a parabola that opens to the left, and opens to the right. But how do we easily determine where does a certain parabola opens? That is what we are going to talk right now. So let's start. Okay, the equation of a parabola opening upward that is x squared is equal to 4cy. Okay, remember the equation we have x squared is equal to 4cy. If we are going to take a look at the figure, for example, we have here a focus with coordinates 0 and c. Or in this graph, we have coordinates 0 and Two, and then a directrix with um, an equation of y is equal to negative c or an equation that is or in the figure that is y is equal to negative 2. Okay, that is uh, our directrix. It is actually a line. Okay, and then just create a parabola. We can actually measure how wide the parabola is but we are not going to solve for our latus rectum so latus rectum that is for determining how wide the parabola is but for today our main goal is to just simply find for our focus and our directrix so when the parabola opens upward our focus is above its vertex so our focus is, uh, in this graph, our focus is 2 units above its vertex. While our directrix or the line that is 2 units below our vertex. Okay. So let's try to put it into an example. So we are going to determine the focus and the directrix of the equation. So we have here x squared is equal to 12y. How are we going to find for our focus and our directrix? Okay, to solve for our focus, we must absolute, absolutely determine whether our focus lies above, below our um, parabola. So our equation is x squared is equal to 12y, which is equal to our x squared is equal to 4cy. Therefore, we can simply um, predict in our equation uh, that that parabola actually opens upward. So our problem now is just to simply find for what is our focus and our directrix. Okay, so let's try to solve it. So our goal here is to find for our focus the value for our C over here and our directrix or the line, the value of our negative C over here. Okay, so our equation is we have your x squared is equal to 12y and our main equation to determine if our parabola is opening upward is x squared is equal to 4cy so as you can see they are similar our 12 here to solve for our c we must find for our c over here in this equation now 4c is equal to our 12 again 4c is equal to our 12 so we can just simply write it in the in equation, we have 4c is equal to 12. Okay. In this equation, we can now simply find for our value for our c. So, we just simply divide it by 4. Divide by 4. Cancel. We will have c is equal to 12 divided 4. That is 3. Therefore, if our c is equal to 3... Our focus should be um, 3 units above our vertex 
and our directrix should be uh, 3 units or negative 3, 3 units below our direct, I, I mean 3 units below our vertex. Okay, so this is now our answer. Now, bakit para sila? Because, uh, let us recall that the distance from focus to vertex is the same with the distance from our directrix to the vertex. So, they must have the same value. Okay, the difference is positive ba or negative. Okay, let's try to graph it. Okay, so... Our focus is located at the coordinates 0 and 3. Okay. Again, parabola opening upward. And our directrix is located with an equation of y is equal to negative 3. Directrix meaning that is a line. And our parabola which is opening upward. Okay. So, that is what our graph would look like. Okay. Focus above our vertex and directrix is below our vertex. Now, how about if our parabola opens downward? So, here is the equation. We have x squared is equal to negative 4cy. So, can you see the difference between the equation opening upward and opening downward? So, sa upward, our equation is positive 4cy. However, if the parabola opens downward, therefore, you can obviously see yung negative 4cy. Okay. So, if your parabola opens downward, it will look like this one. Okay. As you can see, nabaliktad din naman siya. Our directrix is um, located above our vertex and our focus is located below our vertex because the parabola opens downward. Okay. Now, let's try to solve it. So, our goal here is to find for our focus and our directrix. Our focus is at co coordinate 0 and negative C. Bakit negative C? Because it is located below our vertex. And our directrix, which is y is equal to positive C because located above our vertex. Okay. So, here is our equation. We have x squared is equal to negative 6y. Yung main equation niya to determine if the parabola is downward, we have x squared is equal to negative 4cy. Just like our previous problem, uh, we can see that 4c is also equal with our 6. To find for our focus, the value of our C, for our focus and directrix. So, we just simply have to create another equation. The same from the previous example. We will create 4C is equal to 6. Okay. And then, simply divide it by 4. Cancel. Our value for our C is 6 divided 4. That is 1.5. So, the value for our C is equal to 1.5. Or, you can also transform it into fraction form. But for me, I would like to stick with the decimal para sa graphing. So, if our the value of our C is 1.5, therefore, our focus should be at 0. Since negative siya, magiging negative 1.5. And our line is equal to y is equal to 1.5 this is now your final answer okay let's try to graph it we already know that our focus and directrix is 1.5 1.5 away from our vertex so let's just put dots over here just like what is shown in our figure 
and then just simply locate which is your focus and which is your directrix. Since our equation opens downward, therefore our focus should be below our vertex. Okay, just like that. Um, our that is our directrix that is located above our vertex, and then our focus that is located below our vertex. Focus with coordinates 0 and negative 1.5 as shown at the figure. And then our directrix which is a line that is y is equal to 1.5. Okay. Proceed to our next discussion. We have here a parabola that opens to the right. Now, as you can see, Iba na naman yung equation. Instead na x squared yung nasa left hand side, we will now have here a y squared is equal to 4cx. Now, as you can see, positive 4cx. Okay, positive 4cx meaning it opens to the right. y squared, left or right, positive 4cx, definitely right. Okay. As shown in the figure, it will look just like this one, okay? If the parabola opens to the right, therefore, our focus is um, at the right side. And then, our uh, directrix is located at the left side, okay? Now, let's try to find our focus in directrix with this equation. We have y squared is equal to 12x. So just like solving for when the parabola opens downward and upward, it is still similar when we are trying to solve for our focus and our directrix when the parabola opens left or right. Okay, so let's try to solve this one. So, this is what we are going to find now. We have our focus with coordinates C and 0. So, you can see now the difference. Your C is now located at the X coordinate. And then, our line with equation X is equal to negative C. Okay, the line now is located at the X coordinate. And then, our equation, we have here Y squared is equal to 12X. And then, um... Yes, our um, basis for that equation, we have y squared is equal to 4cx. Again, just like our previous example, we can just solve it similar. Similar, just like the previous example. Oh my god, what is happening to me? Okay, but anyway, let's proceed. So, 4c over here is equal to our 12 over here. And then we can just simply write our equation. We have 4c is equal to 12. And then just simply divide 4. Cancel. Divide our right hand side with 4. We will have your c is equal to 12 divide 4. That is equal to 3. So the value of our c is equal to 3. Therefore, our focus is... Um, equal to 3 and 0 and our directrix the line that is x is equal to negative 3 that is now your final answer focus with coordinates 3 and 0 and a line or our directrix which is which is equal to x is equal to negative 3 let's graph it Okay, so we have here our directrix which is at the x coordinate, x is equal to negative 3, and our focus which is at coordinates 3 and 0. So we can just simply draw a line to show that that part over there is our directrix and just simply show a parabola that opens to the right. Okay, and that is how our graph graph will look like okay let's proceed to our um next feature of the parabola we have here opening to the left okay the equation is y squared is equal to negative 4cx okay the difference when the parabola opens to the right is it is positive 4cx and when it opens to the left it is negative 4 
C X. Okay. Uh, and when you graph it, it will simply look just like this one. Again, reverse na naman. Our focus is located at the left side of the graph. And then our directrix is located at the right side of the graph. Okay, let's have some example. Let's find for the focus and directrix of this equation. Y squared is equal to negative 6x. Okay, let's solve. We are tasked to find for our focus with coordinates negative c and 0 and our line or directrix with an equation of x is equal to c. Negative c because we are opening to the left side. Okay. So our equation we have here y squared is equal to negative 6x. Again, 4c is equal to our the value of 6 over here. So just create an equation. 4c is equal to 6. And then just simply divide both sides by 4. Cancel. So c is equal to 6 divided by 4. That is, which is equal to uh, 1.5. Our value of C is equal to 1.5. Therefore, our focus F with coordinates negative 1.5 and 0. And our line or directrix with an equation of X is equal to positive C equal to 1.5. So, this is now our final answer. So, let's graph it. Okay, so place our dot over here at exactly positive and negative 1.5. Again, our directrix is um, as a like equation of x is equal to. 1.5 as you can see it is located at the right side and our focus with coordinates negative 1.5 and 0 then just simply create a parabola, parabola looking or opening to the left side of the graph so let's summarize our discussion by simply looking at this table that i created so in here, we already summarized our discussion. You can pause it if you would like. And then simply look at the differences uh, when the parabola opens up, down, right, and left. And the focus, um, if the C is located at the Y or the X coordinate. And the equation of our directrix. Is it Y is equal to positive and negative C or X is equal to negative and positive C? So I hope you learned a lot in my video. Don't forget to click subscribe and hit the bell below to be notified for my next update. So up next, I'm going to uh, show you how to solve or how to find our focus and directrix if our vertex is not at the origin okay